use it towards a test that I've been wanting to do, taking a Ronin S and uh, using it with a Bolex. It like just barely balances. You see how it just almost fell right now? It's very top heavy. I'm kind of concerned with it hitting the lens because I have hit the lens once with it falling down this way. When I first set this up, I thought maybe I'd be able to run around and have my eyepiece like this, but I didn't think it was kind of realistic. So what I did instead is I have a GoPro. It has the same field of view as this. It's basically a second viewfinder. Nice. Uh, uh. Have your legs a little bit wider, have your hands stupid. Let me okay. Two, two, one, you're gonna be following, go. Is I didn't anticipate how heavy it would be with film and with the filters we have makes it like a little bit heavier. That's really cool. What you got in that box? I got another camera. Oh, With this, when I had it without film and without the filter in the front, it was running fine, but now it's like. heavy and with this filter and with the GoPro and like with it loaded with film it's really hard to balance not reliable but this is how the shots turned out
Hey, Danny's friend. What's up, Danny's friend? Man, I know you think I'm hot, bro. <laughs> you 